No one really knows how it got to Hernando Beach. It had been here for close to 14 years. The 16 ton, 46 foot vessel was built in California. Sailed all extensively through the Bahamas and the Caribbean. And then somehow, mysteriously, the boat ended up here. The Hernando Beach Marina leaving it untouched for more than a decade until it caught the eye of Hernando County's Port Authority. Since the boat's made out of cement, it's ideal material for a reef. After nearly two years of paperwork and permits, the county finally has permission to sink what they now call the ghost ship at the Bendixon Reef, an artificial reef project about 20 miles offshore that dates back decades. We have 10 M60 World War II Army tanks down there that were sunk back in the 1990s. But the ghost ship will make it the Adventure Coast first official shipwreck dive site. And county officials expect it to be a one-of-a-kind experience for divers and fishermen. So as a diver, when you get down there, it's just full of life, um, lots of things to look at. So it becomes basically an a oasis down there of marine life. But getting the boat ready wouldn't have been possible without the many volunteers that helped clean it out. Without their help, there's no way this project would move forward. Volunteers helped keep costs low and kept the county's vision afloat. And now, after years of hard work, the ghost ship is days away from fulfilling its destiny. Going to go below the waves. That'll be the final farewell. Natalia Verdina, Fox 13 News.